Okay, I just want to say thank you to Lorraine and Larry. You guys sent me such a, a, a beautiful card. I appreciate you guys a lot. Um, we really hope to meet each and every single one of you guys someday. You guys are a real blessing. Thank you for the beautiful card. And get ready, the storm has just begun. Let's go catch it. Yeah. Well, good evening, everybody. It is December 18th, 2023, and the storm in its little patches has begun, in my area at least. How's everyone doing this fine, beautiful December 18th, a Monday? Hope you all are doing well. I'm doing pretty well, just chilling like a villain, doing what I love to do for you guys. Those of you who are fairly new, um, I'd appreciate it if you would consider liking and subscribing. Um, I prefer to earn it, but for those of you who have been around for a long time, I'm sure you think that I have earned it. <laughs> so I'm hoping all you newbies out there will do me that solid and hook a brother up, like and subscribe, and yeah, let's go catch some of this this beautiful, beautiful weather. And it smells so nice outside. The petrochlor, I believe is what that smell is. Petrochlor. I always screw that name up. But it's the smell of rain. I used to call it the, the smell of ozone. The smozone. But yeah, guys. So, all the way through the rest of this evening, the weather is looking like uh, we're not going to get a whole bunch of weather and the chance for a snowflake is pretty slim to none but even if it happens at four in the morning I will be out and ready to record it for you guys and I wanted to surprise you guys I have one of my my little good friends here with me Theo say hi Theo say hi buddy you gotta say hi to everyone roof, roof, roof. oh he's such a sweetheart he wants to come sit in daddy's lap so bad you can sit in daddy's lap that's fine Daddy loves you. Alright. So yeah, guys, it's been a really overcast, ugly looking day. The type of days that I absolutely love. I was hoping with how nasty it looks outside and it looked most of the day. It looked like a lot of weather coming, but this first little brush of the storm is not going to be that much. Um, and then also... I usually, for those of you who don't know, I do a time lapse, either from my house or hotel, wherever we're staying, um, during these storms. And so this isn't going to be a major storm, but it's going to be the first time lapse. I did a time lapse for our first snowflakes about a month ago or three weeks ago. Didn't it, it was just so so boring. Um, and this probably won't be that much different. But for those of you who like the time lapses, that is. In, in the making right now. It's gonna be four days worth of a time lapse at 30 second intervals. So the video will only be a couple minutes long for a four day, four day recording. But I hope you guys enjoy it. And yeah guys, so right now the current temperature is 47 degrees. It's gonna keep dropping while we're out here driving. For some reason when I get into my car, the ambient temperature gauge always reads a lot higher than it, it actually is and it takes a couple minutes for it to uh, to uh, get right, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, y'all, tomorrow we check into that hotel. I'm stoked about it because it's a new hotel and I get to put it in the playlist. I think I've done maybe 19 videos or something in that playlist of local hotels and Airbnbs. So those of you who are wondering where to stay, feel free to check out my playlist. The playlist is called Lodging. Lodging in Big Bear, I believe, or, or just Lodging. And uh, I've got plenty of spots for you guys to check out. Um, not every place yet, but I am working on that. I am working on that. As I said, we get to add this, this new place to, to the repertoire. And I'm excited about it. We check in tomorrow and check out on Saturday. All right, let's see here. So right now we're in Big Bear Village. This is such a beautiful, beautiful place, you guys. The village is gorgeous. It feels like Christmas. They've got a couple random fire pits just chilling out here like that. That's so cool. If you guys are walking along and want to take a little rest, you can sit down on the little concrete bench that surrounds the uh, the fire pit and enjoy yourself. Oops. 
Theo, what are you doing, buddy? Mr. Theo. Mr. Theo, give me a drink. What are you doing, buddy? Theo, what are you doing, buddy? What are you doing? He's so cute. I love this guy. No, oh, Theo. Theo, you're killing me, buddy. Here's our Christmas tree, our main Christmas tree in the village. And here's another fire pit. I'm telling you guys, this is such a relaxing place to cruise around. Once we get some snow, I'll probably do our live feed. One of the live feeds from here, walking around the village. Um, we're going to do, as soon as it starts snowing, another live feed from the house or the hotel where I set it up for like a 12-hour period. And uh, you guys can just keep on checking in and out. Embarrassingly, I fall asleep sometimes on the uh, live feeds and I start snoring like crazy and it's really embarrassing. But I love doing these videos for you guys, so I'll embarrass myself as much as necessary. So yeah, temperature dropped down to 46 degrees. We're gonna take this maybe a quarter of the way to the dam. Actually, it'll be significantly less than that, maybe a sixth of the way. We're gonna end up uh, turning on to, oh my gosh, what's Edgemore? We're gonna turn on Edgemore and take Lakeview all the way back. Right, Theo? Is that, is that, is that what we're gonna do, sweetheart? Huh? Is that what we're gonna do, my little angel? Look at how little he is, you guys. He's a tiny little dog. Tiny little dog. Let's see here. Um, oh my gosh. I'm forgetting something. I'm forgetting something. I forgot to bring the card with me. I'll have to do it next time. One of you guys sent such such a, such a nice card. You guys send nice cards all the time, but I just I really appreciate these things that come from all from all of your hearts. It means a lot to me. It gets me through my rough days, which is most days. So thank you, thank you, thank you. I am doing my best to. Uh, to make sure I acknowledge each and every single person who sends me a card or a donation. I used to do individual thank you videos for every donation. And now I thank all the donation people on the next video. So if I get two donations before I make my next video, then I thank those two people during the next video. Um, a lot of people were getting frustrated with me uploading a lot of these thank you videos and you know I don't feel right not thanking you guys and taking taking the time to make it really personal so I'm still thanking you guys I'll never stop stop doing that I'm, I'm just not doing the individual videos anymore but yeah we're on Big Bear Boulevard aka Highway 18 and we are about to turn on to Edgemore Now we can turn on the brights and get a little better sight here. Cool. Hope everyone's having a great holiday season. I'm excited to get our season, our, our, our wet season going. Technically it begins on October 1st, but as you guys are well aware of, uh, we haven't really had any snow. Of course I caught some snowflakes a few weeks ago, but that, that, that wasn't, that, that doesn't count, you know? This is going to be the first actual, what I consider to be real snowfall. It's not going to be much. And it's already looking like it's going to be less and less. Um, it's showing now Thursday. It's, it's, it's going to be fairly on and off. Or maybe it was Wednesday. Because it was four straight days of rain and snow shower mix. And now it's, uh, it's becoming less and less the closer we're getting towards uh, our closer we have come to the storm so that's a bummer but we will get ours you guys we will and I will be very excited about that when it snows I turn into a completely different person I become a 
five-year-old little boy. Just so excited about it. Okay, so we're coming up to a street called Lakeview. And Lakeview, you travel basically for about half of it, it's homes that are right on, on the lake. And we're turning on Lakeview right now. But yeah, this is something I'm grateful to have caught, which is this little bit of rain because uh, it's so sporadic right now. This is literally, these are the first drops that have fallen where I live near my house, but maybe a mile away they saw a couple raindrops earlier, it's possible. But I never ever miss the first of the rain or snow whenever it hits my area. I never miss it, you guys. I know it's weird, but I take a lot of pride in it. I've been doing this for nine years. Just, I just love doing it. And the best, most exciting aspect of this channel now you guys, nine years later, is you guys. It really is all about you guys. Forget the content, forget any of that stuff. It's the love and respect that we show each other on this channel. It's so beautiful. You guys are such beautiful people. And I count my lucky stars every day. All right, so we're now, instead of going straight, if we go straight, that's Lagunita. And there's a nice, beach or lakeside resort called the, Lag the Lagunita Lodge, but we're turning right to continue on Lakeview. And for the most part, most of these houses on the left-hand side are lakefront property. Just beautiful. Someday, you guys, someday, my efforts and hard work will eventually pay off and I'll be able to live in a place like this. Oh, I know you can't see it, but it's so beautiful. You know what, if I can remember when I go home, I'm gonna find that card. Cause I think Deborah Dixon and uh, all the other people that have, have sent stuff, but I wanna make sure that I got this other good friend taken care of. So I'll probably add that at the beginning of the video, a, a quick little thank you which you guys have already seen at this point, if I'm actually gonna do that. Here's another hotel. This is the lake, uh, the, the Lakefront Lodge. I stayed there with my wife. That's the only hotel that we stayed at that we didn't get the video. Somehow when I did the video, it, it, didn't, it didn't process. And so we're gonna have to stay there again just to do another video. I'm okay with that. Okay, now we're, we're making a left on Lakeview Drive. So yeah, we just keep on following Lakeview all the way to Big Bear Boulevard right up here. Temperature's still maintaining 46 degrees. And as I said, guys, for those of you who are fairly new, any changes that we get, any real decent changes in our weather, I am always out here. And I will always capture what's going on in town for you guys. Also, don't forget, I know I talk a lot, but don't forget that uh, we have a new sponsorship with uh, Get Boards. Get Boards is a ski and snowboard rental company with just the coolest staff, the owner, Tony, is so awesome. Um, if you guys mention the channel and or bring in a can of, of uh, food before Christmas, the can of food thing before Christmas, mentioning me when you go in there, I think works as long as you come up here. Uh, they'll wax your skis and your snowboard free of charge. So that's a pretty cool, cool little deal. And who knows what else? You might get a percentage off when you're buying stuff. They've got the top of the line equipment there, you guys. Just really, really good stuff. The rental equipment is fantastic too. And 
you'll save a lot of money renting there. As a matter of fact, we're about to, to pass it right now. It's right here on the corner of, of uh, let's see here. It's this next block right here. I always forget the name of this. What is the name of this street right here? I'm going by it slowly. That's Get Boards right there, and I can't see the street name. That's horrible. But that's Get Boards. They're there to take care of you guys. Again, they have really killer equipment. Um, I was talking about prices. Compared to the actual resorts, you'll save a good amount of money on your rentals there. And uh, I strongly suggest you give them a chance. Again, you're helping out a smaller company up here. And that's something that I take a lot of pride in, is helping the smaller businesses. And these people are very deserving because they care about the tourists. You guys mean something to them. Unfortunately, I've, I've come across a, a few companies up here that are very nonchalant about the tourists. And uh, kind of, I don't know, have a bit of an attitude about it. And it just blows my mind because without the tourists, none of us get to live here. Without you guys, none of us get to live here. So go to Get Boards, support them, and uh, have a great time when you come up here. Never forget, I'm always here to answer any questions you have. I want you guys to have the best experience possible, which is another reason why I'm trying to collaborate with other businesses up here because I want to be able to get you guys the best deals and um, just the best of the best opportunities and experiences that, that I can possibly help with. That would make my day. Okay, we're on a street called Thrush. And Thrush is the back way into the parking lot at Snow Summit, and that's where we're going right now. We're probably not gonna see any lights on the hill because it's 46 degrees and they're not making snow right now, <clears throat> unfortunately. This wet weather is not good for our ski resorts, I'll tell you that. In terms of the rain, clearly the snow is good for the resorts, but not a really warm rain like this on top of the snow. Not good at all. How you doing, little Theo? You all right, big guy? it up here it's really foggy and nasty looking Theo what are you doing big guy don't don't get any crazy ideas it almost seems like he wants to jump out the window we're not gonna let that happen are we Theo the Theoski Obviously, you guys, don't forget, if you want any Big Bear Weather and More merchandise, we just launched it about a month ago or so, maybe a month and a half. Go to BigBearWeatherAndMore.com and get all your Big Bear Weather and More merch to support the channel. That would be awesome. We are very thankful for that. I'm excited to see people walking around with stuff. As a matter of fact, I saw someone already wearing one of the new shirts. I can't believe it. I expected it was going to take a lot longer than that. But I already saw someone at Stater Brothers uh, yesterday. Couldn't believe it. I went up, said hi, thanked them. It was it, it was awesome, truly awesome. So we are on Summit Boulevard right now. This is the way you would come in to go park at Snow Summit. Today it was pretty darn packed. I'm assuming it's Christmas break for all the youngsters out there. turn on Brownie Lane. Instead of going all the way to the boulevard, we're going to turn right on Brownie Lane, which is the street right before you would get to 7-Eleven right here on the corner. This is kind of a back way to get to Moon Ridge Road. 
I take this all the time, especially when there's snow out here. It's faster, you can get too many crazy drivers on Big Bear Boulevard over there. So I try to avoid that during snow at all costs. And I get everywhere a lot faster because I take these back roads. Of course, during some of the snowfall, I'll be taking these main roads so you guys can see what the road conditions and traffic conditions are like. But for right now, we're gonna enjoy the back. Still getting a consistent drizzle right now. Temperature has dropped down to 45. And we're just gonna take a little stroll through Lower Moon Ridge and then we will be done with the beginning of the storm video. Remember guys, there could be a little bit of a break in, in between videos. Typically with this much of a break, usually I would have to do a whole nother calm before the storm video, etc. But this is all part of the same system. So that's why uh, we're not gonna be doing a, a, a different calm before the storm video. It's all the same system. When it does snow, you guys, I, I will be going to both sides of town. I like to do my much longer drives to, to, to cover the whole valley because people drive up from all different sides of this mountain. And I want you to really be able to gauge the safety from all angles. Thanks again, you guys, for being a part of the channel. Thanks for just being so loving and so kind. I really don't have the words to thank you guys. It's it's beyond beautiful how you guys treat me. So thank you. Theo, you wanna say thank you, buddy? Oh, yes, he's a good boy. Yes, he's a good boy. Yeah, guys, thank you again. And uh, as I said, any changes in the weather, we will be out doing some more videos, obviously in the morning, worst case, if we have to wait until then we'll be doing some videos in the morning. But in the meantime, have a wonderful, wonderful rest of your evening. Um, hit the like and subscribe button, help me out. I'd appreciate it. And as I said, for your ski and snowboard rentals and buying equipment, go to Get Boards and mention me and the channel and they will hook you up. And BigBearWeatherAndMore.com, get your merchandise. Thank you guys again for all the support. Tons of love for you guys and I will chat with you all later. December 18th, 2023 at 9.05 p.m. The beginning of the storm has just begun to affect Big Bear. Peace out, guys.